Okay, thanks everyone. If you could take your seat, we're just going to um, kick off this evening's um, proceedings. So first of all, thank you uh, very much for coming. It's my pleasure to welcome you to the seventh lecture in the School of Design um, lecture series for the 2012-2013 year. Welcome also to people that are joining us online. I'm Ashlyn Kelleher. I'm a new associate professor in the School of Design. And we're very excited to have our one of our own present today, Professor Golan Levin, and maybe it's a measure of the esteem within which we hold them, and that one lecture series enough is not enough for a Golan Levin lecture. This is actually a trifecta of seminar series from the School of Design, the School of Art, and the School of Architecture. So we are welcome to all facets of that today. Golan really doesn't need a huge amount of introductions because he's terribly good at the internet, and a simple Google search will find that he's everywhere on the internet, and all his work is documented, and he's fantastic at social media and Twitter and all that great stuff. So I don't really need to poorly repeat things that are much more um, clearly written about on the internet. But very briefly, he is the um, director of the Frank Ratchie Studio for Creative Inquiry and a, an associate professor here in Electronic Art in the School of Art. And I think his uh, talk this evening, I've known Golan for about 13 or 14 years, and I'd like to say I knew him before he was famous, but he was pretty infamous even when I met him first in grad school and, and has only just accelerated his claims to dubious fame since then. But I think his lecture this evening, he's decided he's going to talk about three primary things. Um, one of being thinking about information visualization as a form of artistic expression. He's also going to talk about the contestational applications of digital fabrication. And finally, this idea of design as a form of cultural invention. So um, we welcome you all this evening, and I'd just like to say thanks to Golan. Thanks. Thank you, Ashling. That was a lovely introduction. I'd like to thank the School of Design for having me in their lecture series. I'd also like to thank the School of Art for having me in a lecture series. And I'd like to thank the School of Architecture for having me in their Encoding Architecture Conference. It's really nice to take advantage of all three of these and get a, a nice combined crowd. Um, many of you are my students, of course. Many of you are my colleagues. I'm really delighted to be able to share uh, with you today. Uh, and so I thought I'd, I'd dive right in. Um, any ideas what this might be? No? Two hands, that's right. Um, these are the hands of this fellow, Merce Cunningham. Uh, I'm just going to jump right into the slide presentation here. Um, a few years ago, uh, at the invitation of the open-ended group and um, George Fifield from, from uh, Boston Cyber Arts Festival, I was invited to interpret some data that was created by Merce Cunningham and the open-ended group shortly before he passed away. 